I wanted to show off my the current progress on the water fountain, but Roxy is gonna leave. Never mind. All right, water fountain. Oops, sorry guys. This is where I'm at so far. This is what was printing last night. The bowl looking thing. And so it's got threads on these two. But I know there's still pieces we have to print. It looks like these threads need to be cleaned up just a little bit. I don't know. I'm not going to mess with them until I see what the other end looks like. No, there's some definite overhang. But other than that, that's literally the only cleanup on this bowl. It's just... Word to the rough wise. Grow out your nails. If you don't have great nails, I'm sorry. Um, but there's ways you can improve your nails. I know they're not all perfect, but I've always had really, really strong nails, so I take that for granted. Okay, so. I don't know that you can even see this, but there's my little, little bit of cleanup. That's it. I mean, in the little test ring around it, but I hadn't played with this until I turned on the camera just for you guys. I wanted to make sure I wasn't screwing with it. It's really smooth. Oh, let me just get this out of my hand. Look, I can even pinch it. It is about, it is about half a pinch of salt. That little bit of cleanup. If you're a cook, you know what that means. But it's, it's about as smooth as can be. A little bit. A little tiny extra. So I'm gonna have to read instructions, but this is where I'm at so far. This from last night. This from the night before. I have one of the nozzles in there, so I think it's the right one, but it might not be, which are printed in black. And then I have the cover, and so I'm assuming it goes like this. Oh, you can't see that. I'm assuming it goes like this because it's got little notches in the top, and they line up. But the instru I have the instructions saved. I just until I have all the parts, I'm not gonna start a you know worry about assembly too much. I'm trying to light up the holes. I know you can't see it, but and then so this will sit on top and then line up hole for hole. With the one closest to my thumb. You kind of see all the pieces lined up. So that 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 hole. Um, but I know I, I know there's a few more smaller pieces. These are all the big ones printed, and I wanted to kind of show it off. And I didn't know how else to do it but a video. And so this is how you got a video. It was originally because Roxy was being cute, but she uh, actually she just turned her back to the camera. She doesn't care. And then I have these three little. I don't know if these are gonna work because only one has the has. It's got about a, it looks like a 10 millimeter, no, it's not even that. It looks like a five millimeter hole that actually passed through, but the rest of these, I don't know if, oh no, I see, the, I see light coming through that one, just a little pinhole, but not this one. This one's solid. So I'm not sure if they were supposed to be printed like that. Um, Or maybe I just need to get pinned to it. I like I said, I have to look up the assembly instructions that I have online that came with the file. But I'm really excited about this. Um, stay tuned to see if I get it working. Right? Yay! Look, 
And there's Roxy. Oh, and that's our, oh, that's our airbrushing station. And this is a puppy butt. You ever see a puppy butt? That's a puppy butt. Is there a pup? Is there a puppy butt? Is there a puppy No. He only has a puppy butt? He only has a puppy butt? That's a face. Hi guys!